we're looking into the number of kids that are injured walking or riding their bikes on their way either to or from school. But it turns out no one is tracking that information. As the Now's Nicole Grigg explains, one mother wants to change all that, and she's already started keeping tabs herself. I know that the student was injured. I know that it wasn't catastrophic. Josephine Amato walks with us along Fishhawk Boulevard, where a girl on her way to Newsom High School was hit two weeks ago. But no one is tracking the numbers locally or on a national level. Josephine points out it's usually only kids hit and killed that makes news headlines. It breaks my heart. It turns out the Hillsborough County School District does not keep track of students injured to and from school. The sheriff's office says they don't either unless they read each report. But most times a deputy will notify the school as a courtesy. If you want to track the numbers, you have to go track them. Josephine, a mother herself, started doing just that, tracking the numbers by using her Safe Bus for Us Facebook page as a place to find out about kids hurt. And we could start looking at those numbers and the real numbers of the children that are being endangered on our roads. This advocate for safe routes to school says it all boils down to unsafe walking conditions, especially with courtesy busing recently removed. She's even offering to help track the data. I am willing to work with the Sheriff's Department and volunteer 100% of my time to start gathering all the information. For the now, I'm Nicole Grigg.